2025 Lincoln Navigator VS 2035 Cadillac Escalade Gets a massive new screen, second row massage seats. The Navigator is bringing the heat to the Escalade with huge upgrades in the first and second rows. The current Lincoln Navigator has been on sale for several years now, and to bring the heat to the recently refreshed Cadillac Escalade, Ford's luxury mark is bringing out an all-new model. The 2025 Navigator keeps the same 440 horsepower 3.5 liter EcoBoost V6 of the old model, but otherwise, it's a different beast inside and out. A huge new 48-inch infotainment display dominates the instrument panel while first and second row passengers can get heated and cooled massage seats. Like the Escalade, the new Navigator is an impressive mix of big wheels, comfort, and technology. The standard 22 inchers can be swapped out for an even bigger set of 24s, and like the new truck's bodywork, they're full of ornate details. Where the Lincoln departs from the recently refreshed Cadillac is how it uses its various luxury appointments, though. A rejuvenate feature combines the vehicle's perfume, ambient lighting, massage, climate system, and more into one big theatrical experience intended to relax the driver. Enabling it begins the show, and there are several different modes to match your mood. This feature, thankfully, can only be used in park. Each cycle of the system lasts 5 to 10 minutes. This is only available to the front row occupants, but the rear passengers are far from ignored. As previously mentioned, the second row can be optioned with heated and cooled massage seats. Even the third row, often an afterthought even in luxury trucks, gets heated seats. If you're curious about the number of USB ports inside this monster, it's 14. The features continue even outside the Navigator. An available, cargo tailgate manager. Feature adds multiple shelves to store your goodies, a bench seat, and even a table. In other words, this vehicle is designed to be enjoyed while parked. Driving the Lincoln should be a breeze though, especially on the highway. Ford's hands-free highway driving system, Blue Cruise, comes standard. Like General Motors Super Cruise, it allows the vehicle to drive hands-free on the highway, sticking in its lane and carefully controlling the throttle and brake. It must be supervised, but it takes a lot of the stress out of long trips. If none of this is enough, there are the two black label models, called Enlighten and Atmospheric. Forget the 24-way adjustable driver's seat. In black label trim, the top-tier Navigator gets a 30-way, perfect position, seat. The interior is likewise spruced up with real wood, premium leather, and what the brand calls a crystal-inspired volume knob. Enlighten is the brighter, lighter version of the black label. Beige seats with gray piping and birch accents. Atmospheric is the moodier of the two, with gray leather seats, black floors, and copper accents. Both include those impressive second-row captain's chairs as standard, as well as a 28-speaker sound system. Pricing has yet to be announced for the 2025 Navigator, but with the current big boy Lincoln starting in the mid-80s, expect the latest edition to inch closer to six figures. The new truck goes on sale next spring. twenty twenty five Cadillac Escalade. This is it. The Escalade has a new face and more features, plus the Escalade V is sticking around for another year. Hot on the heels of the electric Cadillac Escalade IQ, the luxury automaker is updating its gas-powered behemoth for 2025. The Escalade has a new face, a massive touchscreen, and for all you enthusiasts out there, the Escalade V sticks around for another year. If the gas Escalade looks a lot like its electric counterpart, that's because Cadillac borrowed lighting elements from the IQ model and other Caddy EVs like the Celestique and Lyrique. Vertical headlights with LED accents adorn each corner of the bumper, a new illuminated Cadillac crest dons the hood, and on V-Series models and up, even the grille surround is illuminated. 24-inch wheels are available on the gas Escalade for the first time.
but 22-inch wheels still come standard. You can pair a handful of those new wheel options with fresh paint colors like Aegean Stone Green, a Deep Sea Metallic Blue, or Latte Metallic Light Bronze. Pop open the new power doors, open and close, and the 2025 Escalade has a massive display on the dash measuring 55.0 inches pillar to pillar. The driver gets a 35.0 inch display and the front passenger has a 20.0 inch touchscreen with video streaming capabilities. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are still here, and standard, and passengers in the second row even have access to 12.6-inch touchscreens with the optional executive second row package equipped. The 2025 Escalade has the same 6.2-liter V8 engine as last year making 420 horsepower and 460 pound-feet of torque. It's paired to a 10-speed automatic transmission. The bad news for all you diesel lovers is that the 3.0-liter Duramax engine doesn't carry over. The Escalade V, though, still has its supercharged 6.2-liter V8 engine making 682 horsepower and 683 pound-feet. The 2025 Cadillac Escalade and Escalade V go on sale later this year but the company has yet to release pricing. The current 2024 Escalade starts at $112,690 with destination. We expect the 2025 model to see a slight price increase across the board.